TV10 and WRNR are proud to bring you this episode of Law Enforcement Live, recorded on the 28th of December, 2020. Thank you to the Berkeley County Sheriff's Department for allowing us to give you this look into a day in the life of a law enforcement officer. This episode will feature a civil dispute, destruction of property, and an alarm check. Law Enforcement Live is filmed live with the men and women of law enforcement. All participants in tonight's show are innocent until proven guilty in a court of law. Viewer discretion is advised. been here before. Hey. Okay. It is my washer and dryer. I have serial numbers. I could call Renna Center where I Go bought it from. Where, where is the washer and dryer? In there. I was told when I moved down. A year and a half down. Since okay. Year. Or not All a year. Right. Y'all, y'all live together? No. no listen. Do. I moved out because of him. Okay. You got receipts for the washer and dryer? I got pictures yes, of the washer and dryer. Yes, when she moved in to me with the rent, listen. Serial number and all that. Hold and on. I can call Renna Center. Hold on. I can call Renna Center in Hope Mills, North Carolina, and get proof of purchase. I'm going to burn the boost. I haven't done anything wrong. Hold on, hold on. I, I need to get my other Hold on, come on. I won't have to call you back, ma'am. I can, I can call Hope Mills Listen, you might have all them, but when you moved in here, that was hard. That was a down payment. Right, don't interact with her. That was a down payment. Hey, hey, boss, I want to hear your side. So what's going on? I haven't got a chance because my phone got stolen last night at a girl's house. I haven't had a chance to call you yet. So I'm on the phone to boost right now. And I came home, and my window just shot out in my truck. And I just had a recording, they all said the other day, and you seen that the windows was knocked out of my truck. And if you look at it, you can see which way the holes are facing and where they shot it from. You, can, you can pretty point blank that they shot it out. And you ain't gonna be an investigator and see that shit. I got you. Yeah, and the washer and dryer, they're just trying to talk. The washer and dryer was down paying for her rent, rent moving into my house with her stinking dogs and pissing and shit over my place. That, right. That's what it is. All right, hold on. That's Shut up. Let me talk to him. But uh, yeah, this is what it was. What was the. the should, you can tell which way they shot every yeah. one of them out of. I got you. Yeah. So. And now they're just bullshit. I've had my washer and dryer in my room since over nine months now. Nine months since we I don't know when you moved in my house, but you paid no, with no, with no security deposits, no, no, that was payment for that. Yeah, hey, hey, you still owe us. Hey, still, you all stop talking, all right? She still owes I'll, I'll talk to you individually. Stop talking to me. No, that's right. what it is. She, yeah, so, she had no money, she had nowhere to go, she moved she, up here. Did she bring the loss from her? Yes, we're down here for my rent. For my rent, yes, she had no money, nowhere, nowhere to go, nowhere to go. She had nowhere to go, with two dogs, all right. with let two stinking dogs. Let me make dogs. sure I'm tracking. She brought a washer and dryer with her. Well, she, she was a friend of my wife's. She had nowhere to go. So, I, I even look right back here. I had a washer and dryer. 
She said, well, I ain't got the money for the security deposit or nothing to move in. She wanted, and I said, dogs, okay. they're going to ruin my floors my, and stuff. All right. I said, if you're going to bring them dogs in here, you know you yeah, Who, who owns them. this? Me and my mom. Well, my, my, it's in my mom's name. I live here. I live okay, here when she life. brings the washer and dryer here, um, is she... She, oh, she, she has nowhere to go. She's using that as a down payment to, yes, she has to, to, go. to stay with you? Yes. Yes. Okay. Let's see. Well, He's paying. You paid. No. Okay. I told him they could have that. All right. And to get my stuff out of storage, because my storage was in his girlfriend's no. name, Brandy said I could put it in the house. No. And if I ever left, okay. I could no. come back That's and get it when I got somewhere else I to stay. I paid him a hundred dollars. Matt, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I paid him a hundred dollars a week to live here. Let Plus they like kept. Twenty dollar, fifty dollar, and me to death for crack and heroin and whatever else he's on. No, no. I just bought the truck. I just got the My truck. My cousin just bought it. No, see, that's horse. Your cousin bought it. You say your tell cousin the truth. bought it, and that's why they shot the truck. Just tell the truth. Just tell the truth. You're telling on yourself. Hey. So you're saying it's your cousin's Don't. truck, that's and now I have it. Hey, ignore her. Like, Y'all ain't gonna, there's nothing that can be done about that, right? Hold on, that's a criminal issue, all right? What is? Destruction of your window. Yes, it's a criminal Hold on. I'm gonna solve the washer Well, let me get your name so I know who I'm speaking with and all that. What's your name? My name's. Yes. Okay. Yes. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Listen, I wanna know what's gonna be done on my truck. What's your, what's your name and date of birth? I don't wanna, I don't wanna argue with you. Yeah, we'll go down the park. Let's go down the park. Okay. He has a lot of people, a lot of money to draw. Mm -hmm. He goes up and down in that trailer car. Yeah. They call it food. I don't know what the hell food is. Well, look, she's got to go take a son to hold it down for a doctor. Right? Yeah. Y'all be careful. Be careful. Let me go talk to him so I can make sure I can get them out of here. I got more to me about. No, no, no. I didn't think so. Listen, they shot his windows out to the court. Right. And then they and then the younger son got in trouble for shooting, actually shooting the guy the tow truck these two, in the chest. These, these two right here. Can I let them go ahead? I don't know who how, how the hell am I supposed to tell you how to do your job? I don't know what I need, you know no, what I mean? no, no. What I'm asking you, do you suspect them of destroying your vehicle? Yeah, I, yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't. I mean, I suspect them or, 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 or Billy. Yeah, him or Billy. One of them. Yeah, I don't know, but uh, I don't know. Like, I, I ain't trying to put their names. Y'all do y'all investigation part. I didn't even call y'all. She called y'all. I didn't have a chance to call y'all. Yeah, I don't. This is bullshit. Mm -hmm. I got it. this. Is bullshit. They, 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 they knocked out over there. All right. Well, the washer and dryer thing is a civil issue. You're gonna have to go down to the courthouse, get civil paperwork. Y'all two were in a relationship. No, we won't. Y'all live together. Yes, you are. I came out here for it. When no, we're not in a relationship. You were. No, I've never dated him. We're a family. Man. He said we live together. We was a family. Together. You're in a relationship. Oh. All right. You lived in the house together at one point. Well, did the cops say come well, out here down the, the line said the dryer, off. washer and dryer was in that property. Unless you can unless you have like receipts. I can call and get receipts. Then I call, have then call and get receipts, go to the courthouse, and you're gonna have to get you're gonna have to go through the court system. And I was told as long as I had went, proof of purchase, listen, I can get my property. Listen, back. listen. When the court system says 
that it's your property, then I can be involved as far as taking possession of that property or help you secure that property. Until then, that's not I'm what not I was in, told on December 24th. I'm not involved. By, by the watch commander. By who? By the watch commander. Who? The state police. All they right. told me as long as and I have proof of purchase. Call state police and have state police handle it because that's not the way we Why were Why are you being like, I'm the one that called you because I'm the I one being stolen from. I understand that. Are you but crazy? You but the thing is, but hold ain't on, nobody hold shot the window down, man. Hold on. The thing is, the thing is, I can't take it. I can't take your property back because of the situation. It's a civil issue. It's not criminal. I was told it as was, long as I could show proof of purchase that I own that no, property, that I could go back in that home and take my property back. I didn't get. I gave them a queen size bedroom. Uh -huh. And I paid a hundred dollars a week okay. for a daggum room that was that a six by nine cell was bigger than. I got you. And then I paid six after I paid the weekly. I started paying monthly. Mm -hmm. I paid him six hundred dollars a month. Mm -hmm. Then he went to jail, started threatening that he was going to beat me. So I moved out. I was told when I got somewhere to put my washer and dryer that I could come back and get it. Okay. He told me that on the phone from jail because I sent him money in jail. I got you. Still not a cr criminal. It's still not a criminal aspect. I can't help you out. They didn't You're gonna have just to get through the my system. windows out. They tried so to steal I, my and so I got to go and pay more money than my $800 washer and dryer because this crackhead says it is his. And even though I got proof of purchase and proof of ownership. Do y'all even know how to do your job? Damn, North Carolina's better than this. All right, well. No, um, I'm gonna get, what is your commander's name? Because I want to talk to him. You can, Lieutenant Jones, that's fine. Lieutenant what? Right. Lieutenant Jones. It's a Jens, J-E-N-N-S? All right, Jones. I'm not gonna help you. Okay, whatever, I know you If you're not gonna listen. I'm gonna talk to him about destruction of his properties. They didn't just shoot my windows out. They tried to steal my truck. I'm holding the for that one. That's perfectly okay. Don't remember. That's Matt, he threatened to beat my ass the other night, too. Come here, come here. No, he threatened to yeah, beat my yeah, ass the other night. Come here. Hold on, Justin. Matt threatened to beat my ass the other night. Oh, shit. On December 24th. Did you, and you called the police on that? He threatened to beat, he spit in my cousin's wait, face. Wait, wait. He threatened to beat, we did call the law out okay. here. And, what did they and the watch commander that came out here uh -huh. told me all I had to do was show proof of purchase. What, now and what, I could go get now my washer and dryer. Now you're telling me something different. Now what happened? That's state police, all right? I'm not gonna piggyback off of what state police said. All right, they're a different organization. All right. Oh, can I get your name, please? Yeah, that's what I'm doing. Okay. Ain't nobody shot your windows at. Why don't you go look at the people you owe money to for drugs? Don't even act like you don't do heroin and Molly and everything Listen, else. Lisa. You got you had people in here from Jersey the other night. Lisa. Calling me, telling me, don't let them steal your TV. Hey, Lisa. What? Lisa. Lisa. Ma'am. You can see the BB holes lying clean. I don't have they a baby gun, man. Ma'am. Line straight up with some Hey, can I get some peace for a second? Let me. Let's get some peace. Oh. All right. Nobody shot it from over here, shot his window I still down. have to investigate that. because That's fine. They're, they're, that is a criminal element. That's fine. As it's far, a criminal element of him having all this drug traffic coming back and forth. Ma'am. My truck getting messed up. I can't do I can't do anything about that right that now. That baby holding my truck right now. What am I going to do, shoot my own truck? Who shot up his truck? You don't know. know. It was like that when I pulled up at 9.30, 10 o'clock last night. Right. Like I said. Well, they did. All right, call me back, baby. Hey, when I talked to dispatch, they said that somebody <laughs> shot a pellet gun. We don't own a pellet gun. Okay, well they- All well, this, we have shotguns. This, yeah. We have 22s and stuff like that. Okay, I got you. But I'm Another saying, one, look, there's a you see the BB hole, right? I mean, I can't verify that's a BB hole, but- Look, it's it look, right there. It looks like a BB gun could do damage. Okay. Right. Now that looks more like- He said he's pellet gun. Gun. That looks like pellet gun. They have a 20, they have a 22 in there. <laughs> It's a civil issue. I know, it's, but I, I left it there with the. With that's and that's the problem. He because, told me I could come get it. And ma'am, I'm telling you, there's no. 
I can't make an arrest. I, can't I don't want seize, you to arrest I can't him. seize your property. I don't because want it's not going out. Get because of your relationship, it becomes a civil issue. Good. Why? Because I rented a room from him? Yes. That's, that's a six by nine sandwich bed. I gave him the queen size bed. I gave him a brand new air conditioner. It becomes a civil issue. But how is it so, fair? So, I've got to go pay so money. I'm, so I'm telling you on how to go to the court system. You can file paperwork. And, so right. he, and he's gonna screw up my washer and dryer before I get it there. It's unfortunate. Because Brandy said she was gonna go file papers to get her truck back, and now it's Monday. It's unfortunate, but it is a civil issue. I don't know why state police would tell you that. Okay, let me tell you. I this. really don't think they would tell you state let me police. Tell you this. If state police wanted, oh, could have taken okay. your property back, they would have done it there. In the I didn't have nowhere to put it then. He told me on December twenty fourth, the night him and Brandy was gonna fight. He told me then. Hurry up and get somewhere and go get your I said, okay. Mm -hmm. Here I am, Monday, got him getting ready to get a storage building. Now he says I can't get it because somebody shot his windows out. That's why he says I can't have it. I didn't do that. Okay, and that's the part with the fella gun. Okay. Yeah, yeah he was... says that we did it. No, we didn't. Because Brandy, my cousin who bought that truck, because she won the $4,000 at the casino, and was going to go get a bill of sale and file the charges at civil court today. I just talked to her last night. That's neither here, neither here nor there. That's nothing to do with me. Mm -hmm. I'm not gonna mess with nobody's truck because I don't want nobody to mess with mine. But all of a sudden, the, the day that she's supposed to go file the court, the court stuff, now miraculously somebody shot out the windows. You what? see what you see what I'm saying? Yeah. They have he had two black guys up here the other day from Jersey, didn't know him from Adam, calling me and my brother telling and my two brothers to watch the trailer and not let them steal anything out of it i said do you want me to make them leave no not right this second we're on the way back okay um all right he goes up to that trailer park God but knows as how far much. as the reason you called me i called you about getting assistance to to go in there and retrieve and my I property and i can't do that that's no i, mean, I didn't want it, you to touch it's, it it's going to be a civil issue I didn't want you to touch it, but see, the only reason why he says I can't have it now is because somebody shot his windows out, and we didn't have nothing to do with that. Probably people he owes money to for drugs. Give but it's in. kind of funny how the day Brandy was supposed to go file court papers, come get her truck back, now the windows are shot out. And because the windows are shot out, he says I can't have my washer and dryer now. After he's been telling me since July 22nd that I could have my washer and dryer. Because I gave them the air conditioner, the brand new one I bought from Audi. Mm -hmm. And I gave them a brand new $450 queen size mattress and box spring and a $1,200 cherry headboard, footboard, slats, everything, bed frame. And that bed frame's in that, in that barn right there. Only thing I said I wanted was my washer and dryer because I can't find that model anymore. It's a Whirlpool Cabrio Platinum Edition, extra large capacity, all digital. Mm -hmm. Okay. It's, got, right. it's got the wire a hosing. It don't have the regular hoses. It's got the wire ones. Mm -hmm. Okay. He um, told me I could have them. And all the right. reason why but I called do you But do you understand that's a civil issue? No, I don't. What do you not understand? I don't, I don't understand because I was told by the watchman to come out here on December 24th because I didn't take charges out on him then why for threatening me. Then what? Because he told me I could have my stuff and I just stayed to myself. Then why don't you call? Why didn't you? Because call I thought that's who was coming out here. Why didn't you call? You don't never come out. Berkeley County don't never come out here. I've dealt. State I've police. Dealt, I, I've dealt with you multiple times. Not me. Yeah. When you see, yeah, you're from North Carolina. Mm -hmm. Right. I just told you that. Who's he gonna arrest, Matt? Yeah, I mean. Unless you saw saw who did it, buddy, I can't uh, I can't arrest anybody. But uh, as far as criminal acts go, here this is this there's obviously a crime. Alright. I All right. Hey, Matt. Matt, is there any way you can just let her have the fucking water? No, there's a mine. I mean, I think you all use them. No, they're mine. He she gave them to me. Uh, that was mine. I mean, she never paid no deposit the screw. And there's dogs. Her little dogs came and, and pissed all over, all Hold over on. my car. Hold on. So you're at hey. uh, close to me hey. forever to get the Shut dogs up. out of my house. You were in jail hey. when I bought my right. washer dryer. Can you get her the washer? Can you get her the washer dryer? Oh. Yeah, you can like wash your hands. It's 
probably worth it long. No, I'm not working her. That's fine. She paid me nothing. I had to get my carpets clean, man. Her dog's pissed on all over the room in there. She's very disgusting. She was homeless. She had nowhere to go. She had. To, she was thinking. Her stuff was in a storage building. She gave me that stuff. No. I'm not arguing with you. I'm going in my house. If you're not obviously not going to get in, I knew you wasn't going to do anything about my truck. I'm going in and activating my phone. I can do something about the truck. Do you want something about the truck? Do you have insurance? No. I just bought it. I just got the truck, man. I just got the Shut the f up, Lisa. Hold on. Let's relax. Shut the f up. Oh, I'm a fat cat, really? Well, why don't you give them all your drug dealers' names, Matt? Dumb. I did. I sure did. I didn't know the I said because I wanted assistance to retrieving my property. That's another guy's truck. That's what they do. They get away with shooting people. They just can't just trying to do it here. They Listen, you see that? Look at my damn dash all tore out. Look here. Hold on. Ma'am, Lisa, Lisa, can I talk to him without you interrupting? Why would, would I tear my own dash out if I got the fucking key to my own truck? All right, fucking idiots. I got you. I got you. But can I talk to him? See, that's more of a thing. This destruction of property is going to steal my truck. Look at my dash all tore down. Take anything from your vehicle? Yeah. They took all my jacks and all, all the other jacks. Go back right. I don't guess they took anything. I know they wanted the vehicle to spot like me. The wind vehicle to spot like me. No, I'm just curious. The vehicle doesn't come back in your name. No, I just got it. I haven't even, the DMV's when? closed. Yeah, I haven't yeah, done when, anything. When, yeah. did you, when did you buy it? I just a couple days ago. I have, my mom just had the title. I was, she's just here. I just got my truck keys in. For one, the DMV's been closed for two weeks. For one, okay. and for two, I don't have a license, man. Okay? Working on it. I'm not in a rush to run down that? to the DMV and get it. Oh. How the, much you pay for it? All right. How much you pay for it? $500. How all much? Right. With 500 from the right. title, so I ain't I'll talk to, I'll talk to you in a minute. That's how I think. I'm sorry. He's basically my brother paid 4000 for that truck. Okay. Gave it to the boy, got from her hand to his. Did they repeat it for it to someone now? No. Okay, then. There's no crime. Uh, no, baby, he's lying. He's lying. He may be lying. I don't have evidence that he's lying. I'm trying to get evidence. I'm not arresting you for anything. All right, or charging you. I'm getting ready to get. I'm getting ready to have witnesses to tell you about my washer and dryer and about this truck. Ain't nobody shot this out, but Sorry, anybody that he you, owes money I to. I told you, you gotta tell you it to a homeless. judge. You gotta go through a court system, man. It's not me trying to be disrespectful. That's fine. It's just and the way it's it is. Lovely to know. It's just the way it is. Lovely to know how the law enforcement around here treats military women. Okay. Well, so what do y'all want me to do? I mean, what do you, there's nothing to do, right? I, I didn't call the law. I already know unless I seen them doing it, which I didn't. Y'all ain't going to do anything. And I'm not going to sit here and lie and say I didn't see them do it. I didn't even call y'all to begin with because I already knew you was going to say 
and it's not only a matter to where you're going to be able to until we're going to be able to like you know get them to pay back uh restitution you know restitution is yeah. If somebody I, commits I, a crime I, against I, you, you know, I, you get paid back. I owe $8,000 to the state. I know. I know all okay. that. Okay. All right. I didn't call y'all. She called one. I should call y'all. I don't know. I already knew y'all was going to Do you want a police report that. for your truck? No. Okay. No. All right. All right, sir. Good luck. Yeah. So if I end up putting my hands on these people, you know what I'm saying? They did something, you know what I mean? If, I, if they all gotta come back here, because I put- I'm not advising, I, I can't I, advise hey, you to fight I don't anybody. wanna fight, listen, don't fight I don't anybody. wanna fight. Stay in your house. But if, uh, you know what I'm saying? You gotta come back out here, for I'll put these motherfuckers I'm on. Tell, I'm, I'm telling you, on. hey, this is what I'll tell you. If they challenge you to come out, you challenge to come out and fight them, you know, you could get yourself in trouble. Oh, if, if they happens, come, happens on my if, land. if they come, if they come onto your porch, uh -huh. try to come into your house. You know, different story. But even on my land, I would, I wouldn't risk it. I'm not saying you can't. I'm saying, be the bigger man, stay inside. Call us, we'll show up and make them leave. Even uh -huh. though I know by the time we get here, they'll be gone. They'll be back on their side. Do you have internet on it? Yeah. Google the uh, Berkeley County Sheriff's, or sorry, Berkeley County Magistrate Courthouse. Court. Yeah. Do the magistrate. What if he messes it up before I can get to court and get it? Then what, and that's the unfortunate thing is when you run into situations like this. So what you want to do is that's what he did with go his get it as quickly as possible. If there's damage in the court, uh, finds that you or the owner of the property and all that stuff like that, they, there's a possibility that they could charge him with restitution fees, which means which means he would he would owe money for it to um, get it protected. He was in jail. He was in jail. Yeah. I'm just saying. He was in it jail. It does. That doesn't. That doesn't matter. But what I'll tell. I'm gonna give you some advice. You're not gonna listen to me, but I'll say it anyway. Get out. Get out of here. They're they're always in, this this family. Whether it's what whether it's you or not, the people who live there are always in a tanglement with that the crew over there. And the family over there. Okay, I've come up. Well, that's a blessing. Yeah. But these three trailers, I mean, I've been out here that's why we for numerous skate. times. Sometimes numerous because times. Of the I'm traffic like, he's got going in now over there. I, I, I don't not believe. I, I believe that there's I mean, a we're good possibility that he's doing it. And we were getting along the other night. But because I brought Brandy over here to separate him until my cousin Melly got here, he threatened to hit with my ass. And it ain't the first time. I got you. That's why I moved out to begin with. Yeah. And I moved over here. They took me into their home, their family. They've been good as gold to me. Uh-huh. All right. All right. Well, we're going to get out of here, all right? You understand that situation? You can call my, you, you, you can call my commander by any means. Stand in front of doorways.
Anything that looks like any kind of fourth century or mm -hmm. suspicious. Mm -hmm. Is that all? 